Hi Plastics, welcome back to Drifting Plastic. We are on our way to the doll fair. Let's see what we can find. <laughs> Oh, look, there's that uh, LOL doll. Yeah. Yeah. There's Abby. We have that Abby, right? Let me see. Yeah. Is that Gloom Beach? Do we have her? Uh, no, we don't no, have we this don't one. No, we don't have her. No. That's pretty good. Cool. Show me that one, Alex. Show me that one. Pick it up. Oh, cute. We bumped into our friend Maria who gave us an awesome deal on some dolls. Look how beautiful these sun and moon goddess Barbies are. Oh my gosh, we are obsessed. Say hi to my sister. Oh my god, look at that snow white. They're so cute. What are they? Take that would cost $200. $200? <laughs> <laughs> I have to make money. <laughs> oh, these are so pretty. So pretty. Oh, it's a raven over there. This one? Yeah. This This one? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Look at the brats over there oh and the most high there. What Oh, hi! We took a cute photo with Andrew and his doll. It was so nice meeting you, Andrew. Yeah. 
<laughs> Air roll. Oh my god, this one. I knew overwhelmed. I'm very I'm so overwhelmed. Like, I'm like, what do I do? I like, do I? <laughs> 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 Look at the red one. <laughs> Hello, Drift and Plastic. I know, but look at the school spirit. Uh, Wow, these beautiful dolls, they are so tall and they just have the most beautiful clothing and styles. Um, the ladies here at the store were teaching us all about the history of these dolls and how they were made and who made them. They're just so stunning. We are obsessed. We got to meet a subscriber. It was so nice meeting you, Kathy. Oh my gosh, that was so much fun. It and was. I can't believe how many good deals we got. Yeah. Yeah. We got so many dolls, guys. Yeah. Do you guys want to see everything we got? What should we start with? Let's start with Ever After High. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh, I didn't even know where to begin. So these are our first Ever After High dolls. So don't come for us if we don't know who's who. We're still learning about Ever After High. Yeah. But educate us in the comments on what we need to know. And if these are like the correct outfits yes. and everything like that. Because yeah. we think some of them might be wearing some Monster High gear. But we'll get into that. Yeah. So I think let's start with our... Queen of Hearts, I believe she is. Yeah. Oh my gosh, she's so cool, guys. Look at her. So we got her for how much? She was priced for 60, but the lovely lady gave her to us for 50. Yeah, so yeah. good. And apparently she got everything. It's yeah. a complete set for her. Wow, she's so, so pretty. Like her accessories, her clothes, like her face. So, so pretty, guys. Let's take her out and have a look at her. Yeah. She comes with a little bag too. Oh my gosh, look at her outfit, guys. So cute. So, so cute. Oh my god, I just want everything ever after high now. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And she's in such good condition too. Like, Very good hair condition. is clean. She's yeah. got a slight mark here, but I wonder maybe we can get it off. Yeah. But nothing crazy. It's an easy fix, I feel. Yeah. Yeah. You know, a lot of people were comparing the Barbie Dream Besties to Ever After High. Mm -hmm. Now that I'm seeing Ever After High in person, to be honest, I don't see it. Like, what do you think? I think the the face sculpt, um, the big face sculpt, is similar, but I don't I don't see the resemblance at all. Yeah, I mean these girls look a bit more like I know like they've got this like older looking beauty, like almost like a porcelain doll. Yeah, they remind me of. Yeah, like very whimsical fairy tale, but I don't see that with the Barbie Dream Besties. They mm. just kind of look like the Barbie. You know the Barbie Extra Minis? Yeah. Like, right, they look like that, heads. but bigger. Yeah. Like, that's what that reminds me of. Yeah. Anyways. What do you guys think? All right, who do we have next? I'm not sure who this is. What's her? Is she the same as her? Raven Queen? Raven Queen. Right. Yeah. 
So it says mixed clothes on this one. <laughs> so I guess her clothes must be from another Ever After High, maybe. Yeah. I'm not sure. But I think we got her for cheaper than 15, didn't we? We got her for $10. For 10, yeah. yeah. So that was pretty good. She's super cute. Her hair needs a little fix, but you know, mm. nothing crazy. So pretty. I wonder whose outfit that belongs to. Yeah. I'm obsessed with these heels. Oh my god. Do you think so they're cool. hers or someone else's? I reckon her the bracelet is hers, like the accessories are hers. Yeah. Um the And the earrings. The yeah. earrings, yeah. Like the waist um chain is hers, but the rest is not. I'm not sure. Mm. Yeah. Let us know guys, are these hers, these yeah. heels. It's so pretty. Then we got this girl. I think she's like a Pinocchio doll. Oh, yeah. Because look at her skin. It's like wooden. Yes. How cool is that? That is so cool. I'm obsessed. I oh love my God, it. Her stockings. Yeah, and look at the, like, the little... Yes. I don't know what you call that. Like mechanical, I don't know. <laughs> like where they've like put some <laughs> screws in or something. Like, yeah. yeah. And her yeah. stockings are such good quality. Yeah. And she got suspenders too, just like Pinocchio. Yeah, yeah, so cute. But it's like, yeah, she's she's definitely like a wooden Pinocchio doll, I'm yeah. assuming. Look at her cricket hair clip. Oh my god. Oh yeah, because um Jiminy Cricket. Yeah. Oh wait, she's even got a bit oh, of a wood yes. texture on her face. That is so cool. Oh my god, that is so cool. I didn't even notice that before. Yeah. Did you even notice the wood on her skin? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> now I do. <laughs> She's so cute. So, so cute. Then we got another Raven Queen, I'm assuming she is. Or mm. is she different because she has blue hair? I don't know. Yeah. Now she looks like the same. Same kind of character, right? Yeah, with yeah. her um, purple eyes. Yeah. Yeah. So cute. So cool. This outfit is like so Victoria. awesome, though. Yeah. I love it. Yeah, it looks like she's complete, I think. I mean, minus, like, any accessories she may have come with. Yeah. But, yeah, still really good deal, because 10 bucks as well. I know. Yeah. Such good prices. It's pretty. Another Ever After High. Mm. Very cute. Hair's a bit wild, but it's okay. <laughs> Easy fix. But still really good Very quality. Good. Yeah. Yeah. I wonder who she's supposed to be. She's giving, like, Cinderella vibes to me. Yeah. What do you think? I have no idea, guys. She's just so pretty. <laughs> <laughs> Which queen is she? Yeah. Help us. Are these ones called ghouls too? <laughs> <laughs> we call every doll ghoul. <laughs> okay, now this one's really interesting. <laughs> oh, yeah. She's definitely wearing a lot of Monster High gear here. She even got a Monster High car yeah. with her. From what I can see, it looks like she's wearing Venus's uh, Gen 1 Monster High outfit with maybe like Claudine's waistband. Mm -hmm. That's what it looks like to me. Yeah. It does definitely Claudine, hey? Yeah, with yeah. the Monster High Scarlet and the Crescent Moon and everything. And like Stefan said, she's got a Monster High comb, which is awesome because we, we want more of these. Yeah. So. I mean, it's a bit messy. It's got some hair in there. Yeah. But, you know, we can clean that out. <laughs> And she's got Dracula's iconic boots. Oh my god. Which is kind of fun for us because we don't have uh, like the OG Dracula. Yeah. So it's kind of cool seeing her boots in person. Yeah, her boots are so pretty. Do you think I'm she's the Queen of come. Hearts? She looks like Queen of Hearts, hey? Yeah, she does. Yeah. Now this one's interesting. She's the first one in Ever After High that I noticed has no arm articulation. Mm. So like she's stuck in a pose. Yeah. So I want to know like is that like a different like gen of Ever After High or what? Yeah. But also I'm not sure like about this outfit because I mean these boots feel like they could be Abby's or yeah. something. <laughs> and is this like Spectra's dress? I'm not sure. Right. Like it's you know I'm not sure what's going on here. Is she is she like a, an Ever After High basic doll because Maybe. the top is hard? You know. Oh, and it is too, yeah. yeah. And yeah. the no articulation. No. And is she, like, part of a beach line? Maybe. You know? She's giving, like, Anna from Frozen. Yeah, she does. <laughs> With her hair and everything, yeah. like, the hair colour. Yeah. yeah. But these boots are so awesome. So yeah. happy. <laughs> yeah, let us know about this doll, too. She's so cool. 
we were able to get a box Ever After High Ghoul. She is our first purchase from the fair. Mm -hmm. This is our first boxed Ever After High doll oh as well. God. Yes, I am obsessed with the box. Yeah. So, so pretty. But what are we going to do? Are we going to unbox her? Do you guys want us to unbox her? Let us know. I think I want to unbox her. Yeah. <laughs> I do I want to know what's this story in here. It says yes. it comes with a story and stuff. I just want to like, yeah. I really want to see. She's so, so cool. But these boxes are beautiful. Yeah. You know, I never recall seeing these in store. Ever. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. But I'm obsessed. I am too. Can't wait to, you know, get more of these boxes. Yeah. Fries. Like from the line, there is Madeline Hatter, Apple White, Briar. Briar Beauty. Briar Beauty. Yeah, I want to get all of the, the other dolls. So cute. So, so pretty, guys. Now, what do we have next? Monster, Monster High. <laughs> We've got all of these Monster High ghouls. I spotted this Cleo and oh my god, oh my ra, I must say, she's so so pretty. Mm -hmm. Her hair is a mess, but um, yeah. I'm obsessed with this asymmetric fringe. Yeah, oh my it. god, yeah. yes. I thought she was Nephra. Yeah. But yeah, she's Cleo. There's just something about Gen 1 Cleo that slays. We got good deals on these too, hey, like yeah. $20. Yeah. Most of them. We got most of these ghouls from the one store. Mm. And the lady was so, so lovely. Next up, we have Abby. Oh my god. Her hair is too wild, but I am obsessed with these boots heels. Yeah, yeah me yeah. too. So, so pretty. Wow. Happy. I think out of condition wise, she's probably the least good condition. Mm. Like she has a bit of discoloring on her face. Yeah. And a little bit on her leg, it looks like here. Mm. But I think if she has a little bit of a clean up, I think we can get her looking decent. Yeah. You know, and her hair needs a bit of a fix too. I think she can look quite good if we just tidy her up. Because her clothes look pretty good. Yeah. I think it's just like the skin a bit discolored. Guys, let us know. Do you have any tips to fix the discoloring on the skin as well? Yeah. Now, next up, I believe she's the Fiki Fusion um, Claudine Wolf and Venus. Yeah, Claudinus, isn't it? Yeah, Claudinus, yeah. Yeah. She's so pretty, but like, look yeah. at her face, look at her clothes. I want all the Fiki Fusion. I know. Her. Her knees a bit... Her heels are wild. Yeah, so wild. So pretty. Her skin colour though, like... Wow. Yeah. Pretty obsessed. doll. I'm obsessed with her hair. Yeah. What's going on with her knee, but... <laughs> yeah, but otherwise, it's so much fun to have in our collection. She seems taller too. She's really tall. Yeah. She's like a head yeah. taller than the normal Claudine, Claudine, yeah. Then we have another Claudine Wolf. Claudine Wolf. Claudine Wolf. Which line does she belong to? I'm not sure, but I know I've seen her before. Yeah. In looking at online listings. Yes. Her clothes feel very um, much alike the Descendants dots. <laughs> but her boots are beautiful though. So cute. We have another Abby. Is this from Gloom Beach? I th I'm not sure. Did Abby go to Gloom Beach? I can't remember. <laughs> <laughs> but look, this one's got a bit of that problem too, of the yeah. discolouring on it. But I think that happens a lot with the glitter on the skin of Abby because it's like the glue or maybe or something. Yeah. I'm not sure. Mm. But yeah, she's so hot. Oh my god, her heels are cute. Yeah, wow. Look Obsessed. at that. So ghoulish. And we have another juice because we had to get him. Look at him, guys. She's... I'm obsessed with his pants. He's so cool. I want them in real life. Yeah. <laughs> Look at him. Now, is he missing his glasses? I think he would be. Because yeah. most likely he would have them. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think he's complete. 
But his outfit slays, honestly. Mm. Yeah. Oh my god, the shoes. He needs a little bit of a fix here and there with like, he's a bit dirty, but yeah. he's okay. But have you noticed how pale his face is compared to his neck? Mm. Maybe that's like some discoloring on the neck. Yeah. I'm not sure. But yeah, he's a, he's a cool doll to have. So cool. I'm excited. Love these pants. Yeah. Now we have Gulia. Oh my god. There were so, so many good Gulias there. So many. Yeah. Yeah. Hana. Oh my gosh, she's so pretty. Her hair. Her hair is wild. I'm obsessed with and her. And I think outfit. the elastic band gave out. <laughs> but yeah, look at her face. So pretty. And see how fuller her lips are mm, compared to yeah. um, Crip Production. Yeah, they are too. Yeah. yeah. Wait, is this our first Gulia Gen 1 that's not crew production? Correct. Wow, it is too. Correct. Yeah. She's so cool. Wow. Her pa colour palette is everything. I know, I'm obsessed with Gulia. So pretty. I want this jumper dress. Yeah. So cute. And now we have a few boxed ones. We have New York. Um, what's her name again? LED. LED. Yes. So pretty. We've got Voltageous Hair Frankie from Gen 2. Oh my god, our first Gen 2 our doll. Our first Gen 2 doll. Yes. And you know what? I know Gen 2 gets a lot of hate. And look, we've looked at some of the pictures of Gen 2. And, you know, some of them are a bit questionable. But this looks like a lot of fun. She looks so, so cute. And then the last box Monster High we have is the VIP Claudine Wolf. Yes. So pretty. Oh my god. I'm obsessed that with her. So pretty. She looks so slay. Yes. There's something about Gen 1 and Claudine that's just so cool. So cool. Yeah. Yeah. I think we'll be unboxing these two. All of them. Yeah. So stay tuned for that, guys. Yes. Let's take a look at all the Mycene dolls we got. <gasps> we are, oh my yeah. god, we've got so many Mycene dolls. So many fair. Mycene. And guys, you'll be excited because I know a lot of you have requested in the comments prior for us to get our hands on some Mycene dolls. Mm. And we finally have them. So let's bring them out. Yes. These are all of our Mycene dolls. So again, we don't know names or anything like that. So bear with us, guys. Um, but this one was my favorite when I saw her. Yeah. Again, we don't know if they're wearing the right outfits or what, so educate us in the comments, please. Yeah. Oh my god, I was obsessed with her dress. Like, I love it. So, so cute. Cool. And her okay. elastic band sort of broke as well. Yeah. But how cool is, like, those uh, early 2000s uh, low light? Yeah. Very cool. Yeah. Oh my god, her makeup is everything. Yeah. She's so, so cool. And these boots! Wow. I can definitely see the brats in Spo though. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and my favorite my scene doll, Miss Lindsay Lohan. Like I knew and she is complete. Yeah. A complete set. Yeah. And you I got her for 40. Yeah. Yeah. She's priced for 50, but the lady gave us Gave her to us for 40. Because we kept buying things from her store. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we kept going back. We're like we just another look. look again, <laughs> you know? Take her out. Oh my god. The quality of the Mycene clothes, though, are insane. Yeah. Like, they're so cool. Like, so detailed. Yeah. I mean, granted, there's not a lot of articulation. Very reminiscent of Bratz. But their knees do bend. So they have, like, that bendy yeah. knee feature. So, I mean, you can give them a little bit of a pose, I guess. Yeah. Um, so cool. I wonder how well they'll stand on some stands, though. Yes. This is what I, like, you know, my cousin had back in the day with her Barbie. Mm. You know, like the knee band. It was very popular. Yeah. Like that, yeah. And the plastic is a bit softer. Yeah, so, so cool. Now, this one we have here, it says her name is Nolene. Mm. Allegedly. So, here she is. Super cute. I'm obsessed with her yeah. face. So pretty. And her outfit is super cute too. Yeah. Yeah. They all look so tall. They do. And like, they just have like really good quality. Yeah. Like, their clothing is insane. I don't really understand the choice of the shoe situation though. Yeah. Like, it looks like Bratz shoes. Yeah. But then you take it off and they have feet inside. Yeah. So I don't know why they just didn't do an open shoe like Barbie. 
Maybe they wanted to have a bit more of like a brat style shoe, I don't know. But... Hence the lawsuits. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, like, where's her toes? <laughs> Like, but it's very cute. Hey, we heard a rumor that my scene is making a comeback next month, but apparently there's no other news. So, what do you guys know? Any of you my scene fans out there, let us know. Yeah, we have Chelsea. Wow, she is pretty. Oh my god, I love her top and her denim skirt. Very, very early 2000s. Yeah, I love yeah. her auburn hair color. Yes. With the gold highlights. Wow. Such a 2000s throw yeah. throwback. And her makeup too. Very, um, very Y2K. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and her boots are very brats. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so pretty. Miss Chelsea. Man, I feel like we've been sleeping on this goal line. Oh, you know, yeah. it's so pretty. Yeah. And like, it just reminds us of growing up because yeah. of the fashion and everything, you know? Yes. Like, it's just so, like, this was everywhere when mm. we were younger. Yeah. And we have all the boy dolls, which are really cool. So, I feel like they're so super cool. trendy. Yeah. Like, I love their fashion. Like, this guy here, like, he's, you know, just everything. Mm. Like, he's socks with the sandals and everything obviously it's like a plastic sock but it's such a cool design yeah. and like really good articulation these ones have too yeah like i don't know why maybe it was a different line or something but it seems like the, all the guys have like full articulation yeah not wrist articulation but you know elbows and knees so you can give them some really cool poses yeah yeah he also came with these sunglasses and his hat which he's wearing Super cute, very 2000s vibe, and a boombox, of course. Yeah. Which, you know, we all had one of those, and this little CD poking out. I love it. Yeah. I'm obsessed. So cool. We really want some more My Singles in our collection. Yeah. Yeah. Have to. Boxed, unboxed, Unbox everything. everything. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we have another boy doll here, a different character. This fashion, oh my god, I used to wear, like, I think we all used to wear this everywhere we go. Mm. You know, like the, the pants. parachute pants, yeah. you know, like long sleeve t-shirt and stuff like that. So cute. And he comes with his trophy. And then he plays football. So, yeah. And look at his um, shoes. So cool. And he's got his little whistle here too. Is he a referee? Maybe. And we have the same character. I think this outfit's my favorite. Yeah. I would wear this now. Oh my god, look at his corduroy pants here. If they feel so they good. They feel like, like legit pants. Yeah. And the clothing. Oh my god. So so like good quality, you know? I love his sneakers too. Yeah. So cute. I feel like I'd wear this outfit now. Yeah? <laughs> I love the necklace. The whole colour palette? Yeah, it's so, so cute. cool. A waist articulation. Yeah. Oh, wow. So cool. Like, <laughs> look. <laughs> <laughs> the last Mycene doll we have in Which, box. Yeah, this is the only box Mycene doll that we were able to get from the fair. But wow, look at his black hair, his guitar. So cool, his leather jacket. Yeah, he's really, really cool. I can't wait to get him out of the box. His name yeah. is River, apparently. River. Where did you see that? Oh, River. <laughs> <laughs> yes, River. We got him for 30? I think 30. 30 dollars, yeah. yeah. Pretty so much cool. everything we got was like five or 10 dollars less yeah. than what was marked on it. What does it say here? You know the way you'd be kidding around with your friends about the cute girls you met the night before and who liked who. And meanwhile, you're text messaging the one with the beautiful eyes and great smile about how freaky it is that you're both so into each other and you just met. That's my scene. So cool. Oh my God, and look at the artwork here. Yeah, I love the artwork. Yeah. Yeah. We'll be unboxing him. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, Ooh brats! 
I think that's all we got. Did we Is this all brats more? that we got? I think so. I don't think we got much brats. Wow. I wanted to get more. There was plenty that we saw. Yeah. But like, we didn't have unlimited funds. So <laughs> there was this Chloe that I saw. Oh my gosh. Do you remember the one I'm talking about? Yeah. I can't remember what she was in now, but she's in like a yellow box, I think. And oh, I wanted her so bad. And the Brat Spa. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. One of those so bad. Mm. Yeah. But anyways, these are the ones we got. So first we've got Chloe here, which again, we don't know if they're wearing the right clothes or whatever, so let us know. Yeah. But we just found her so cute. Like, I yes. love her hair color. She's super cute. Mm. And like, you know, this outfit's cute. But again, I feel like something's off about it. Something's like, maybe off. it's not the right shoes or I don't know. Like, yeah. but... I mean, she's super cute. Super, super cute. Like the doll herself, like I love her makeup and I love her hair. So we yeah. had to have her. And we only got it for like 10 bucks, so why yeah. not? So this one is definitely wrong, we feel. This brand. Yeah, yes. yeah. <laughs> I feel like someone gave her a haircut, restyled yeah. her. I don't know. Like maybe this jacket belongs to like a boy doll. I don't know. It just seems too big for her. Yeah. But she's kind of a vibe. She's so cute. <laughs> to get her. Name. Custom? Custom? Custom brats? <laughs> Um, but yeah, we do try to look her up online to see which line she belongs to, but we couldn't find any Yasmin looking like this. Yeah. So, yeah, but she's, she's so cool. Yeah, let us yeah. know where does her outfit come from, does it belong yeah. to Yasmin even, or someone yeah. else, but otherwise we still love her, the doll, her makeup looks so pretty. Yeah. And like, the clothes are really cute too. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. And again, we got her for $10. And the last Bratz purchase we got was this Bratz selfie stick doll. Yeah. Now, she would be from, like, I guess the Gen 2. I don't know if they, if we, if we call it that. Mm. But, like, when they sort of rebooted Bratz, like, yeah. a while ago. And it didn't do that well. So, yeah. But she, we thought she looks like a lot of fun. We got her at a good price. And so we're like, you know what, why not? Let's like take a look at her. Yeah. She does look like she has some issues though. Like as in the hair looks like it's been discolored a bit at the top there. You can mm. see it's almost looking like a peachy color when I think it's supposed to just be pink. Yeah. Um, based on the picture at the back here. Um, but yeah, it looks like a lot of fun. And I just want to see like what this gimmick is like. Yeah. Too, if it even works. Yeah. And this came out in 2015. Yeah. Oh, yes. So cute. Yeah, definitely they look so different though. Mm. Like the, the face is not as fierce. Yeah. You know, it's a bit softer. Softer. I think cute. the lips are smaller too. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, but her shoes though. Mm. So pretty. And knee articulation. Yes. Okay. This is the first time we saw this doll. It's mm. called Shiba Juku Girls. And her name is Yoko. Like, yeah. we saw her for $10, so we had to get her. Her outfit is so just cute. so cute. Yeah. Yeah. We're going to try and get our hands on all the other ones, too. Yeah. So we got Suki, Miki. Do you want to say that one? <laughs> Shizuka. Shizuka. Yeah. Koe and Yoko. Yeah. So yeah. we're going to try and get the other ones. And if we do get our hands on them, we'll, we'll unbox them. Mm. Yeah. So next up, we have something quite exci well, exciting to us. So we thought at first that she was Rainbow High. She's actually Rainbow Surprise. Yeah. Poopsie line <laughs> from back in the day before Rainbow High was yeah. properly a thing. At first, we thought she was like the big Amaya Rain. And then when we got her, we just bought her because we thought she was so cool. And then, and then when we got home, we were like looking at her and I was like, wait, something seems different about her. Like she yeah. seems like something else. Then we realized she didn't have the glass eyes or the rooted lashes or anything. So then we realized, wait, she's the, you know, Rainbow Surprise dolls, which we were already looking at before and yeah. wanting those. And guys, she's in really good condition. Yeah. We don't have her bag. But I feel like we saw her bag there and we must have forgotten to get it with it. Because, like, I mean, at these stores, like, everything is just kind of everywhere and you have to, like, really look at what you're getting. So we're going to see if we can contact the lady who is running the store and 
see if she has the bag for her because I think she was supposed to and we might have left it behind. I'm not yeah. 100% certain. But she was in the back under some other doll, so we had to dig her out. So glad that we, yeah. we were able to see her because, yeah, we love her so much. Yeah, her hair's not uh, even in bad condition either. Yeah. It's a bit of a brush and stuff, but... It actually feels really nice. Yeah. She's really clean and she was really looked after. Mm -hmm. And oh my God, we want the others now. I know, it's so cool. And I believe this part comes off. Yeah. So you can put slime in there. <laughs> Just like the Rainbow High world. <laughs> yeah, the Rainbow world was definitely inspired by this clearly. Yeah. Let us know guys, do you guys have the Rainbow Surprise collection? Yeah. I want all of them. They are so expensive them. online now. I know. In box, they're insane. Ta-da! Okay. Our favorite ghoul. Yeah. <laughs> Our friend Maria, if you're watching this, hi. Hi Maria. Who we bumped into. She gave us a good deal on some of the dolls, which she's already shown you guys. Some of the Monster High dolls that were in box and everything. Yeah. And Ever After High. She also chucked these in for free for us. So, which was really cute. So, thank you for that. Because we actually were wanting the Barbie car in our collection. So, yeah. a lot of fun. Yes, I love this car so much. And we already have some of these ones in our collection. But we're going to give this one to our son. So, he yeah. can have a Monster High Goomobile as well. Yes. This is my favorite purchase from the fair. Mm. A Generation Girl doll. You know what's funny? Just before the fair, you were looking at these online. Yes! And we didn't even expect to see any of them there. Oops. Oh my gosh, guys. She's in really good condition. Really good. She's so clean and she comes with a whole set, with her bag, with the chair, her second outfit, her stand as well. Like, wow. And what's wild is I looked at the date on the back as well and this doll is older than me. Yeah. And I feel like I'm more run down than her. <laughs> <laughs> She's also older than me. So much older. <laughs> but yeah, no, super cute. Like, oh my god, these accessories I'm obsessed with. Like, look at these yeah. hair curlers. Like, what a throwback. I'm in love. Oh and like the hair dryer? Are yes. you kidding me? I remember seeing these accessories with my cousin's old Barbies. Yeah. And I used to be obsessed. Yeah. And, and like, I... hello, the telephone? <laughs> <laughs> Are you kidding me? What is it's even so this? Cool. But it's such a cool item. So yeah. Cool. Very 90s. Love yeah. it. Yeah. Wow. And her little lookbook, you know, with her outfit and everything. Look at that. Yeah, so cute. Vintage supermodel. Mm. Yeah. Speaking of her lookbook, she's got a second outfit, which is so slay. And you know what? This quality is so good. Yeah. Like, I'm obsessed. Like, I want more Generation Girls. Because it's like Barbie Generation Girls, right? Yeah. Or is it separate from Barbie? Separate. Right. Separate lines. Yeah. Yeah. So cool. Like, look at this puffer vest. I love it. Yeah. Wow. The quality of the clothes is just so good. So insanely good. Oh my god. Let us know. Let us know, guys. Do you guys have any Generation Girls in your collection? We really want more of them too. Yes. Obsessed. And we got this Barbie Extra number one. Yeah. Wow. I spotted her on the stall table and I was like, oh my God, we need her. Yeah. Because we have most of the Barbie Extra line. And when we tried to look at, you know, getting number one, once we knew like all the different lines and stuff. Yeah. We were looking at her online and she's hard to get. She's so hard. Yeah. She's so expensive. And we got her for what? 30 bucks. $30, guys. So that was a steal. And she looks like in really good condition. So we'll definitely be unboxing her as well. Yes, we love her. I want this one. We yeah. have this girl already, but we don't have her, do we? No. No. So cute. Yeah. Love the Barbie extra line. Love, love, love. And last but not least, we have the OMG styling head. You know, not long before we went to the door fair, we were doing one of our toy mate shoppings. 
and we saw this and we're just like, you know what, it'll be so much fun to have it because we've got the Monster High Frankie styling hand mm. and having that in our collection, I don't know, just seeing it on the shelf, we, we like it. You know, it's just, we don't really play with it once we've styled it, but yeah. it's just fun to have like these styling heads, you know, like on top of the shelf and everything. Yeah. And having a low one will be so much fun too. It's just so cute. Yeah. yeah. We'll definitely be doing a video on this, guys, like styling her hair and everything. So stay tuned for that. Mm -hmm. And we got this for a good deal too. Today. Very good, very yeah. good. She was priced for 25 uh, but we got her for 20 Yeah, so thank you. Oh, guys, we got lots of really cool things at the doll fair. And this was our first doll fair that we've ever been to. Yeah. And it was just so much fun. What would you say was your highlight of the doll fair? I think being uh, apart from finding all the dolls, we got to meet a lot of cool people there. You know, Nick, Andrew, Cheryl, many, many more. Yeah. You know? And thanks to the ladies at the Glamour Us doll stand for teaching us a very cool history of uh, the beautiful dolls there. Yeah, guys, those dolls, I mean, we talked about it earlier in this vlog, but oh my God, they are just... So stunning. You know yeah. what? They were only selling them for like 450 I think, each. Which we expected them to be more because, I mean, I feel like even the camera doesn't do justice of how nice these dolls were in person. They were like so tall. They had beautiful fashion. Just iconic dolls. One day we will have those in our collection. I swear we have yeah. to. Yeah. But I think for me, my highlight was probably... Yeah, I would say, like, meeting subscribers as well. Like, we, we got a few on camera for you guys who wanted to be a part of the vlog. But, you know, I think it's still so surreal bumping into you guys in person, you know? Mm. And it's just, like, hearing your guys' story. So, like, if you ever see us, like, in person, whether we're shopping or at these doll fairs or whatever, come say hi because... It just makes our day talking to you guys and getting to meet you guys in person. When we were there at the doll fair, we were told that there's going to be a few other doll fairs uh, later this year in some other locations. So we will be attending those as well. So keep an eye out for those vlogs too, guys. Well, Plastics, thanks for watching this video. We hope you enjoyed it. Let us know in the comments which dolls you want to see us talk about more, which dolls you want to see us unbox. We'd love to show you guys. And if you liked this video, don't forget to subscribe, hit that like button and comment something down below. If you haven't already, please hit that notification bell so that you get notified every time we upload here on Drifting Plastic. Bye, Plastics.